Hey guys, it's Justin from Star Wars Fanatics, and I'm here to tell you guys that they have cut the list down for the um, Han Solo actor to three finalists. So a little information about the Han Solo movie is that um, it's being directed by Phil Lord and Chris Miller. It will come out during um, May 2018. So that's about all we know about it so far, except... Um, a few, I think it might have been a couple months ago, they um, had the, uh, they had a list. I think it was cut down to about five or six actors for the role of Han Solo. But now, there, were, there are reports, like online, you can, it's everywhere right now, that there are three finalists, which are Alden Aaron Reich, Reich, I'm not, I have no clue how to pronounce that. Never heard of the actor, but I looked online. I did I did some research on these three actors. He was in Hail Caesar, which came out um, not that long ago, just a couple months ago. I heard it got decent reviews. Um, another one was uh, Jack Rayner, who was in Transformers: Age of Ultron. With this one, I've heard his name. I haven't seen Transformers: Age of Wait, did I say Age of Ultron? I meant I meant trade Age of Extinction. I was thinking of the Avengers movie. So yeah, I haven't seen much of his work because I stopped watching the Transformers movies after about the second one. They just didn't really appeal to me that much. And the third actor, which I'm very excited about because I know who this actor is, is I'm honestly not sure how to pronounce his name, but it's Taron Eager Egerton, which um. He he will be in Eddie the Eagle, which comes out soon, starring him and Hugh Jackman. That looks pretty good. But why I'm really excited is is that he was like the main character, well, one of the main characters in Kingsman: The Secret Service. And if you guys haven't seen that movie, that's a very, very, very good movie. It's it's like heavy on action. There's a lot of blood. It's just it's just awesome. I, that's what was one of my favorite movies that came out. I think it was 2014. Probably one of my favorite movies of the year. Except for X-Men Days Future Past. But um, this has been Justin from Stars Fanatics. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys later. Bye.